yeah, the, the, there was a clinical Kent about uh, uh, the uh, right uh, canine is about um, four millimeters higher than the uh, left one. Three to four, four okay. yeah, three to four millimeters higher. All right. Okay, and then were you seeing the midline as being on with facial, or is that something? I mean, you, you know, mid, mid, midline is approximately one to 1.5 millimeters uh, uh, to the uh, right side, but you see the midline is canted as well, so once you okay. correct the cant, it's, I mean, the upper part of the midline at the papilla is relatively on the facial midline, and the, mm -hmm. the, the dental midline at the incisal edge is off about 1 to 1.5 to the right. Okay. All right. I think we're set up um, pretty good here, so I'll go ahead and come uh, into final occlusion. Yeah, let's verify the, um, uh, the head position with the markers. I, I did some facial markers with a mm -hmm. laser pointer. I uh, just want to make sure they're on the... That in the, that frontal view they leveled uh, that yellow line. If we can just drop it uh, down to that, uh, to, yeah, just to make sure. Okay, so that's pretty good. Okay, we're leveled there, and uh, let's do the side view as well, please, just to see. Okay, so we are. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's that looks about about right. That looks about right. There may be. Okay. Um, yeah, Kuzul plan is about 13. Yeah, yeah, I, I think that looks about right. <clears throat> Perfect. Okay, so I'll come to the occlusion and go ahead and uh, mark that cant and midline that we're seeing here. Here, but you can see um, that our our um, upper dental midline is pretty much on with facial now, and yes. then uh, we're looking pretty level in that anterior segment. And then at our canines and molars, we're about a half a millimeter discrepant, uh, but overall, yeah, yeah, kind she, of the difference yeah, she has a too. difficult occlusion with uh, multiple missing teeth, so yeah, that's acceptable. We'll go ahead and just come to that profile view now, and what sort of advancements did you want to make here? We're thinking doing four millimeters at the incisal edge, uh, at the upper. Okay. And uh, doing the occlusal plane correction of uh, approximately um, to 95 to the uh, to the true vertical, uh, and in your case uh, to. Um, Five to six degrees. Let's see how it looks. So the upper, uh, 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 yeah, the upper. How many degrees? Yeah, upper. Uh, the uh, the uh, upper first molar should drop down about six millimeters on my two D planning. So uh, I think, uh, yeah, let's do let, let's do six degree change now and see what happens. Okay. Okay. So. I went ahead and rotated it at six degrees. We're at a four degree occlusal plane now. Um, right now, the right side is that, that right molar here is dropping down about six and a half, and the left molar is close to its original position with the can correction. Okay. Okay. Uh, you want to rotate that far, or do you want to come back a little bit? Uh, come back one, one uh, point nine, so it's five degrees. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, because her. Okay, so she, yeah, we're coming down six at that right molar now. Yeah, because she's so retruded, she really needs that big advancement. Yeah, I think that's uh, that's about right. Okay, um, and then did you want to keep the vertical position of the incisal edge the same? Uh, no, no, we'll, we'll drop it about uh, three millimeters, uh, uh, about two and a half, three. Uh, yeah, let's do three, three millimeters down. Three. Okay, so if we drop that anterior three, you're now bringing your right molar down about nine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you want to 
keep that right molar to only coming down six? Mm. I think uh, I think she looks pretty good like this. Okay. So. Uh, All right. So we'll come forward four and down three at the incisal edge. Uh, at right molar we're coming down nine. The left molar we're coming down about two and a half. And if we look at the mandible, we're coming forward let, let, twelve at your lower incisors mm -hmm. and sixteen at pagonia. Yeah, let's do two millimeters at the incisal edge instead. Let's see what, what, what that does in there. So, yeah, one okay. millimeter up. Yeah, so coming down two, we'll bring your right molar down about eight now. Mm -hmm. and, okay. and, and then, um, and, and then how about if we do a occlusal uh, uh, change, like half a degree uh, back? You okay. 5.5. 5.5. Mm-hmm, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think that's uh, that's pretty good right there. Yeah. And then I'll do okay. the rest of the chin. Okay, yeah. So uh, that Pagonian is coming forward 15.8 millimeters right now. Uh, Pagonian 15.8, uh, yes. Yes. Okay. And then with the chin? Oh. Yeah, okay. Uh -huh. I'm just going to go ahead and see if there's any to correct here, which it does look like our left side is flared out quite a bit here in the mandible. Do a little bit of some clockwise rotation here to kind of help those proximal segments lay nicely here. You look pretty even now, and then you wanted to go ahead and take a look at that chin as well. Yes, yes. Chin will do uh, five millimeter uh, down grafting and uh, three millimeter advancement. Okay, and then um, we'll come forward four and down three. Were you hoping to get guides for this? Uh, no, no guides, just. Uh, no guides, okay. So coming down five, do you just want uh, uh, to be five in the anterior of the chin there? Mm -hmm. How do you guys do guides? Just uh, like the plastic guide? Uh, mm -hmm. I've never used it. I, you know. Uh, uh, yeah, and with um, it sounds like you you need this coming up here in the, the next couple of days. Is that correct? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so. Normally our guides take a little longer to turn around than that. Um, that's, that's, if you if you would need them for this case, so you could try to fit them in. But mm -hmm. yeah, so okay, so we'll come down five in the interior here. Let me look at that gap. And you said you wanted to come forward three. Is that correct? Yes. And, and down and down five. Uh huh. And yeah. And let, let's drop this little point down at the back, so that like the whole mandible is just longer without that little step there in the back, please. Okay. So. Yeah. Um, I, I don't know if you can. You want me to bring this up a little bit, or? No, no. That back corner that connects to mandible, just uh, so it's so it's lined up with the um, with the lower jaw. Uh, Okay, so you just want it to be um, L yeah, like straight. St yes, 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 yes. Uh huh. Yeah, like this. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so that's yeah. Dropping straight down five millimeters and forward three. Mm -hmm. How, oh, what, what is the uh, Pagonian advancement now? Pagonian now is at eighteen point eight for your advancement. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, can we change our occlusal plane just a just a smidge, uh, like maybe mm -hmm. just very very little? Again. You want to um, maybe. increase or decrease it? Uh, increase just a little bit. 
No, no, about I, six I, no, there? no, no, de decrease, decrease. I'm sorry. Okay. Back down to five. Yeah, five point one or something. Yeah. Okay, so that's about twenty millimeters per volume. I think that's uh, that's pretty good right there. Yeah, I like that because I can okay. always uh, advance the chin a little longer if I need another millimeter to twenty. So yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's that's what we're gonna get. Yeah, I like that. Okay. Alright, and let me just look from the front real quick. And it looks like your chin is, um, there's really no correction to make from the front there, so you should be good. Yes, yes. Okay. <clears throat> um, any other movements you want to take a look at here, or are you happy with this final position? Um, I think I'm happy, yeah. And preoperatively, pre okay, uh, preoperatively, calm dials were pretty seated uh, with a splint, right? So we're good there. Yeah, I'll double check that here real quick. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks like it's pretty seated. Yep, they both look mm -hmm. like they're seated mm -hmm. really well here. So, are you going to be doing um, maxillary surgery first? Uh, or mandibular. Mandibular first. Mandibular, okay. Okay, so your first contact is going to be at these left uh, canines right here? Yes. That'll be your intermediate position from a profile mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and from the front. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's pretty asymmetric. You, know, you don't realize when you look at her mm -hmm. face, she has a lot of soft tissue that hides it, but you know, it is pretty. Certainly, certainly. This cheek is so we'll small, too. We'll go ahead and uh, correct all that for her. All right, and then as far as your splints go, I want to make sure I do with what you'd like here. Do you want that intermediate splint to have uh, no flange on it? Uh, intermediate splint, uh, just like we normally do, that so it pushes yep. time okay. out of the way. Yeah. Perfect. And then the final splint will put some uh, some wiring holes in it and a yes. little bit yes. of how it'll build up for those segments. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Um, so I'm looking at, it sounds like you're going to be. Uh, Let's see, leaving on Friday, is that correct? Yes. Okay, so um, what we'll do is, uh, you know, build these tonight and, and have them out to uh, Thursday morning. Will that give you enough time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thursday morning okay. uh, or, you know. Yeah, no, we completely understand. No worries. Um, we will, you know, kind of just get this get this in the works here today and have it uh, build overnight and ship out tomorrow for, for delivery Thursday. That'll be, that'll be great. Thank you so much. Thank okay. You. Yeah, no problem. And I just want to make sure um, it's just shipping to the usual, right? 911 Reserve yes. Drive, Suite 150. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. All right. Thanks for getting on, Dr. Anapov. And, thank you so uh, if there's much. If anything else I can do, let me know. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. You're awesome. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thanks, Mike. Bye. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm. Bye. -bye. Bye.